fun. I mean fun, guys. Let's do this. Let's get started. What you do if you with you? You! I will deal with you! Amarachi Ashley Amusi. So Ashmusi is from the uh, Ashmusi is the Ash from Ashley and Musi from Amusi. And yet, there we go, Ashmusi. Very simple. Okay, what well, I do, like you guys know, I'm like an award winning brand influencer in Nigeria. One of the top most social media influencers, the king of adverts, you know, literally the most creative baby girl when it comes to these adverts. Yes. And then also a content creator. I'm a skip maker. I'm also a businesswoman. Yep, I'm a businesswoman as well. I have my hair company and all that. And then lastly, I am an anatomist. Yes. I'm not practicing anatomy, but I suffered for many years in school. So yes, I am an anatomist. Uh, I started making skits in 2018, May, June. Right? 2018, May, June. But then, um, okay, well, I, when I started making skits, I wasn't very super consistent like that. I was still doing Slay Queen content chat mixed with the skit. So I started being very consistent in the skit making like 2019 slash 2020, get. So yeah, I, I, I have a couple of videos that have actually caught fire and just blown up that everybody reposted. In fact, there are a lot of them, so I can't start counting and remembering each. The, some I did with them, Chuka, the real Chuka, some I did with Noto, Ada Jesus, and so forth and so on. Okay, I remember a few, like the last Indian shoot I did with him, for Scatter and the rest of them, it caught fire, it blew up, everybody liked it. Um, there was also one I did recently with Papi Mika that the guy, you know, <clears throat> he broke my bones. Yes! So I was good too. And if you, the other old ones, I can't remember the exact stories, but I see them, I shall remember. So when I started skit making in 2018, right, it wasn't like a business thing, it wasn't a way of cashing out and making money. It was just because I wanted to act. I knew I could act. I had the passion. I had the talent. You know when you're a good actress or when you have a talent and it's burning inside of you, you always know, you will know and you want to chase it, whether acting or music and all that. So I was chasing Nollywood earlier and then the skit thing was happening on social media. So I said, okay, let me dive into skit. Since Nollywood was sort of proving, you know, one or two. Oh my God, not today. Not today. What do you mean? What is this? For goodness sakes, I was trafficking at you. I was Just telling you. Car. What do you mean I eat your car? The other side of the road is even bad. Just look at it. Look at it yourself. Just look at it. Young lady, you, you just bashed my car. Oh, no, what do you mean? Are you new, are you new in Nigeria? The roads are you, bad. You're, you're supposed to go this way. I'm, I'm, I'm going this to, way. Supposed to is a function. Man to is another thing. Okay. That place is bad. Hence why I took this. And I was I was flashing you. What? Can you just, can you just keep quiet and apologize? No. Apply some common sense. Please. Are you serious right yes, now? Yes, I'm very, very serious. If you apologize, you're going to go on your way. I'll listen, listen, your girl. You don't say that. Listen, listen to me. You don't say that, okay? Okay, welcome, princess. Okay. What's going on is your prince has hit my car. You can't even guess or say he's my prince. You don't even know for dating or not or not now listen to me look at how your car is moving if you had gone that way it would have been very simple what the hell are you saying what are you arguing just say sorry what really yeah i don't oh, wow. no, so i don't oh really what no, i don't see so it's what it's a bike right and then you're like oh wow yeah girl say sorry girl you're coming close say sorry girl you're coming close say sorry girl do not say sorry girl say sorry girl oh my god you're just what you said 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 what you said
Yeah. 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 This guy they drive me. Oh, this guy they drive me. Let's say they mad. What's going to happen? No, no, why they run? Why they run? No, why they run now? Bro, I go. I go to my house. My dear, don't go. Okay. 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 What like, just I'm, happened? I don't know what just happened. Right now. I'm, I'm just, just, I'm just, I'm just sorry. About mm, okay, about myself, I was actually born in Lagos. I'm from Enugu State, right? But I was born in Lagos, Bagata, you know? And I've been here since then. But my secondary school was Federal Government College, Enugu State, you know? And the university was Madonna, LLL, that's Potakot. But, but ever since, besides these two schools, Sha, I've just been living in Lagos all my life. And right here in this house, we just moved in like last year. I stayed with my family here. Or well, my family stayed with me. So I own the place. So my mom, my sister, they are here with me. <laughs> Mommy, stop, Mommy, stop being dramatic. Mommy, oh my god, this man is so dramatic. guys enough of me already i mean let me show you my mom i should show you my mother and maybe show you the other places like my room okay guys time to get in the kitchen and see every other person in this house <laughs> okay here you go guys meet my mother my mom let me say hi to them hi pvc thank you for coming yeah you heard her right you're welcome and Juicy is checking on the grilled chicken. My chef, Juicy Foods. Say hi to them. Thanks, <laughs> Get out of here. TVC. <laughs> okay, TVC. Sorry. Okay, guys. So let's go upstairs. Let's go to my room and see what's going on in my room. about my skits and I shoot some of my skits in here as well. Now, about thinking of a skit story to shoot, hmm, to be very honest, it doesn't come easy sometimes. You have to stay, listen to music, see some movies, think about some things before stories actually come to your head, like good proper stories, whether for adverts or not, before they can come, you have to like really think deep, watch some movies, get some stories, or hear some music. People have different ways to get stories, yeah. but these are the ways I do my and watch some movies and then just clips. So yes, and then my skit character, Homura Bede, her makeup is right here. So I just come right here to the makeup, uh, dressing mirror. This is Homura Bede's makeup purse. <laughs> As you can see, it looks like Homura Bede. <laughs> I open it. <clears throat> this is Homura Bede's favorite lipstick that you guys know. Let me do the makeup here. I'm going to use this phone as my mirror. My love life. <laughs> okay, first of all, first of all, before I answer your question, you guys know that, I mean, you have to look sort of ugly before you can be funny in your comedy skit, right? Because how will a funny, sexy damsel be funny? A pretty, cute damsel, rather, be funny. It's not blending now, nobody will laugh. But you have to look ugly like this. So let me keep looking ugly. So now, back to your question, my brother. Hmm. That skit that I got engaged to Don Flex, if only the whole world knows that engagement was a skit like you do. It would have been good and smooth. But guess what? On the road, everywhere, everyone, everyone is like, congrats on your engagement. When are you getting married? Yo, congrats. Yo. I get one fine brother, we really like you, but you don't already engage. And I'm like, who decided to engage? You engage me? I'm never marry. Link me up to your brother. He's a skit. I keep begging them, 
please that was a simple skit the skit story that i did with john flex was like um the story of um he was a suitor so he came to seek my hand in marriage you know and then he was willing to do everything except what the world for me so we had to use that engagement anticipation video that engagement short clip as a good anticipation video to ginger them to be ready to watch this kids and that's all though. as for the question that um about the punch interview where i, I mentioned uh people thinking i was going amount to a prostitute i keep hearing that thing in several interviews now the thing is that when i was a teenager right or ever since i was little from small literally i've been this you know kind of um chaka chaka kind of girl you know grab grab babe like hot chick i've always been hot teen. i've been a slay queen since forever do you get so even me going to study medicine was like impossible everyone was like how should we medicine to go keep pressing all those kinds of things there was a brain full everywhere <laughs> you get it okay. if you don't get it forget about it right. there was a, i was like the best students in my preclinicals before i switched yes so it was basically a few of my relatives then and my mom's friends that were like, ah, this girl is too so hot. She can't amount to anything now. Shall she go be? They didn't know what's up. Say God, get greater plans for person. <laughs> my lipstick next. <laughs> it's over. I'm achieving what I want to achieve. I'm fine. I'm all right. Because like I said before, my skip making was out of the passion and talent I had for acting not I, I never I don't even have a CV I'm sorry I, I don't have a CV printed out in, by any chance so I never looked for any job maybe I have one employment and I started making skits it's a lie yo I chose skit from the beginning I it was more like a destiny thing God just saw my destiny I knew that this girl cannot even work under anybody to start with because NYSC working was a problem <laughs> was even a problem already do you get so right from I finished school 2016 I served 2017. The same 2017, I started my business and I started skits right after in 2018. So it just aligned. It wasn't Nigeria frustration. It was like destiny. It was what I wanted. Get that. My YouTube now. I'm I just really got on YouTube and Facebook recently when it started popping. Everyone was like, YouTube making money, Facebook is paying you. Do you understand? That's when I really got on them properly. I've been an Instagram person ever since the past few years. So it was like this year I started with YouTube. So my YouTube is still coming up, it's still growing. I just have a few dollars I've made, like seven dollars actually. <laughs> I can't wait for it to get to hundred thousand dollars like I've been hearing. So I'm still growing it and growing my Facebook as well. So I think I make money from both sides almost equally almost equally but i love business i'm also growing my business and i like business particularly because i feel like business can outlive you your company your business name your brand can outlive you like it can continue even when you've grown old and died it can continue and keep giving your generation money but your videos giving you money also makes sense that's beautiful right but then if you don't shoot any video or you're on a vacation or you're married or i'm pregnant and i can't shoot videos or anything happens and i die god forbid the money's over, like it's done. I want the both sides. <laughs> Woo! Oh my god! Look at my face. <laughs> so guys, my home one rub bedroom makeup is ready. <laughs> now wait for it. Let me go and wear my my full attire, my full costume, and enter character once and for all. now mm. church abasa we are ready <laughs> homer abeda is ready for the game Umba, bring it on bring it on okay i was with someone and then i was forming all hotty ashmusi king big and all that you know and then boom the back of my trouser thought that that would be the most best moment and when in, in one event <laughs> this trouser is it thought that felt that that was the best moment to tear apart and it just opened I first touched it and I was like wait oh, pinch me whether let me know whether it's reality <laughs> so that was really embarrassing for me yeah kingdom me an egg I put my water one pure water inside pot <laughs> when it boils I put in three indomie I put in um, crayfish pepper curry thyme turn it onions pepper egg and put it ready <laughs> five things I cannot live without is water Food, camera, pictures and videos, camera, yes. 
clothes and oxygen. Duh. <laughs> you cannot stress me. <laughs> Money heist. Instagram, of course. Because I love Instagram. I mean, it's super easy to assess and you know what you're doing. You're just having fun. YouTube has rules and regulations. Jesus. Um, Ireland, as you can see. Well, because I'm well to do, so I'll say Nigeria. Because I know it's not gonna be easy UAR as a Nigerian, I guess. <laughs> do Mao or Malbai? Malbai. Malbai. Okay, Maldives, Maldives. <laughs> because I haven't been there, I've been to Dubai, so I know what it looks like, you know, normal fresh life and shit, fine places. But Maldives is water and shit. <clears throat> Davido. Because, uh, because I like Davido, I like his voice, I enjoy his music. Yeah. And he relates with his fans. I mean, he's, he's relatable. You can relate with Tim Sha. Let me know about that. Don't worry. Next question. Nigerian Idol. I just like it. I prefer it naturally. Oh, please bring back good ultimate touch. Of course, I like Bibi Ninja, but when you have and you, when you get something a lot, you want another thing. I mean, please, good ultimate touch next. I used to want to be in Bibi Ninja. I don't know if I still want to be there. Maybe I do, maybe I don't. I don't know. To be honest, I think I've worked with all or almost all the social media influencers and skin makers I know. Um, actors I would like to work with. Amosola Jalade, Genevieve, <laughs> Genevieve Naji, um, uh, Davido. You'll be Mumu. Hey guys, I have told you all about me already. I know you had fun. I mean, you can't deny it. You cannot contemplate it. Alright, it was fun doing this with you guys as well. See you next time, some other day. Thank you.